Hi everyone, welcome to my channel. In today's video, I've got five classy but casual spring outfits to share with you. These are outfits that can be recreated really easily with things that you may already own, or you may need a few bits and pieces to recreate the look. I'll show you where you can pick everything up in all kinds of budgets. Let me show you the first outfit. When the spring comes along, it doesn't mean that everything that you own that's dark has to be banished to the back of the closet. Dark blue or black can look wonderful at this time of year. Just pair it with some pastel shades or some florals for a more spring-like feel and it can look great. A black pleated skirt isn't something you would necessarily think of for a spring outfit, but paired with a floral blouse or shirt can look lovely and it still feels spring-like but not overly feminine. Wide leg trousers are on trend this season and can be paired with a floral blouse to look casual but smart. Block coloured pastel tops and tees always work well with a darker bottom and a casual jacket looks great in a pastel tone looks great too. I love this look for a casual outfit. It's all very basic pieces that work so well together and the pink style jacket is perfect for the spring. Any style of black jean or trouser would work boot cut, straight legs, skinny, whatever style you prefer. Add a basic white t-shirt, this you may already have in your wardrobe, and then add a pink jacket. I like this style of jacket, which has a casual feel to it, but it still has an elegance to it. This jacket would work perfectly to recreate the look. It's around about £25, so that's around about $35, something like that. If you have a bigger budget, there's these from Hugo Boss and Calvin Klein. Or if you don't like the bomber style jackets, this is a drawstring style. And this one comes from Lily Silk. I've recreated this look with a jacket from Amazon. It's from Vera Modo, which is a brand that I'm not that familiar with, but I know lots of you know the brand quite well. This is about £30, which is about $45. And I think it works well to recreate the look. It's a classy, casual outfit with simple, unfussy pieces that any age or size could wear and I think it's a great casual spring outfit. Breton stripe tops are a wardrobe staple for lots of us, me included, and I do think they'll be around forever. They're the perfect spring capsule piece because there's so many different ways they can be worn and styled. The most popular type of stripe top you generally see is the black or blue stripe, but a red and white stripe looks gorgeous with white jeans and it does make a nice change. A coloured stripe top is another nice alternative with some casual trousers. It does mix things up a little bit. A nice way to style a blue and black stripe top is by adding a coloured bag in a really bright colour. I do something similar and layer it with, with a trench coat and a red bag to add a splash of colour. The Breton stripe top is also a favourite of Queen Letizia and the Duchess of Cambridge. They've both been seen several times in a stripe top. A favourite way to wear it of mine is with pink in spring. It's a very feminine way to style it and I think it looks lovely. Just like the last outfit, something like this could be done with any style of white trousers. This is a long sleeve striped top, but a short sleeve one would be fine. Here's a couple of nice ones I've found. This is from Bowden and the puff shoulders gives it a nice twist. I also really like the Le Redoute tops. Two other pieces you need for the look are a pink blazer and some nude or some pink flats which are very easy to get hold of. These nude flats are from Tory Birch. They're currently in the sale. These are from H&M and these are from Hobbs. Three different price points for different budgets. There are pink blazers out there, but lots of them I've found are quite oversized. This is the best fitted one I could see, which is from Marks and Spencers. The pink bag looks gorgeous with it, but a tan or white bag or even a black bag would look great too. Longline cardigans are great in the springtime when it's too warm to wear a coat but not quite warm enough just to wear a t-shirt. They're a great cover up and worn right I do think they can look quite classy. This is possibly more of a summer look with a long line cardigan but it could be adapted for spring with a thicker dress and the closed toe shoes. When you need to layer up on a chilly day a cardigan worn over a classic white shirt with jeans looks great and any colour would look good just like this. I love navy with white at any time of the year, but especially in the spring. A plain navy cardigan with white underneath 
really does look lovely or a pattern cardigan with wide leg trousers also looks great and I thought this look was absolutely gorgeous a lovely classic outfit for spring it's just four elements two basic pieces white jeans and a navy t-shirt then you need some Chanel or Chanel type shoes there's lots of dupes my favorite are these from Express but these are nice too then you just need a long navy and white cardigan I found a couple some are not quite as long but will look just as good this one is Tory Burch it's gorgeous but it's pricey it is reduced but it is still expensive there's also a shorter one too and I found this one this is from Jack Wills it's not quite as long but it looks lovely when I did search there weren't that many navy and white cardigans but a plain navy one would look just as nice it's a very understated outfit that really does look very sophisticated I wanted to include a casual but classy outfit without jeans in the video. Something that's comfortable but still stylish and I quite like this look. It's another cardigan outfit with trousers rather than jeans and belly flats. Very similar to the last look but with the addition of a statement necklace. More recently delicate chain necklaces or chunky gold chain necklaces have been the trend for quite a while now. But a statement necklace can still add a nice finishing touch to an outfit. Mix and match whatever you have to recreate this look. Neutrals do look nice though for a polished outfit. One of my favourite colourways in the spring is pastel blue and white. It looks very clean, fresh and classy and it can be played around with lots of different ways to make many different outfits. A pastel blue cardigan paired with white bottoms looks great or blue skirt with white top and any style of white top would work and any kind of skirt would look nice too. A pastel blue blazer and white is another nice option. A chambray shirt and white jeans is gorgeous and could be worn open with a white top underneath for a more relaxed look. Or my favourite is a blue and white striped shirt with white. I just love this look and combination in the spring. I also thought this was a great casual outfit with a blue and white colour palette. The jeans are boyfriend jeans and these are the ones that are actually in the picture. This is the best lookalike jumper I could find. It would look lovely with the white jeans. There's this one too. This is from the White Company. And if blue isn't your colour, there's these in lilac and beige. Add a black belt and I think a tan belt will also work well and some black belly flats and it's a terrific spring outfit.